It's kind of neat. Might want to explore around there a little bit more. I don't know if that one door by the uh, the red eyed silver or black knight, whatever one he was. I don't know if that can be open. Might have missed some stuff in that area. It was a pretty short area then, wasn't it? And Orlando is a pretty tiny area then. And it's kind of cool that you go back to the same room that you fight Ornstein and Smoen in the first game. I'm pretty sure that's the same exact room. Wait, what the fuck? Where am I at? This is uh, this is the Way of Blue place. Got Cinders of a Lord and Soul of Alderic. Yeah, this is where we fought Vort. Vort's like just down there. Oh, there's a summon sign here. Hmm, I wonder if there's a boss in here. <laughs> One random summon sign out here? Well, maybe not. Oh, these guys don't do like any damage to me. That's nice. This place look kind of darker. Oh, I don't want to summon that guy. Does the sky look different? I'm not sure. I don't think the sky looked like this. I, yeah, now there's another summon sign there. There's one here. There's another here. There's another here. There's another here. There must be a boss in there. There has to be. Should I help someone with Vort? Let's see. No, this, this place definitely looks different. My God, Will you guys fucking! All right, first of all, you're gonna fucking die first because you're a fucking stupid asshole, stupid ass crossbow. You're there. Second of all, I'm not done with you. Fucking boot that shield out of the way there. And you're gonna get killed just for being here too. Come here. I'm gonna fucking boot, yeah, boot your shield out of the way too. I wonder if I could even get summoned for Vort. What level am I? I'm level 77. The only way I'll get summoned for Vort is if someone's on, like, New Game Plus around my level and they summon me. I don't even have my soapstone out. It's not even on my equipment anymore. Yeah, this place definitely looks... It was a little bit lighter. I remember there was like a beam of sun that came down around here, and then that was blue. I swear that like swirly thing right there, right above my head, was blue. So it seems like uh, it seems like the environment has changed a little bit. Seems like everything's a little bit darker now. But whatever. Actually, you know what? Are you guys fucking? T You're lucky. You're lucky. You're fucking lucky I don't want to fight you. I already killed you, like, a hundred times. I'm not fighting them again. I have 104k souls. I should probably go level up, right? Before I walk into this room where it seems like there's a boss at because there's, like, four summon signs just sitting out there, maybe I should go back and... I kind of want to go and explore Anne Orlando a little bit more. I think I'm going to go do that. Let's go to let's go to Firelink Shrine first. Might take another quick look around Anne Orlando. See if there's anything I missed. Might be a good idea. Might be a good idea to see what I can get from this soul, whether I want to use it for a weapon or not. And I need to put the ashes down. I got a lot of stuff to do. That much is for certain. Anything back here? Nothing back here. This is still fogged off. I actually found patches in uh, one of the other files I've been messing around on. He, uh, he locked me into the, the tower that's not out there. The tower, you get an Estus Shard from it. You get the Firekeeper Soul from it. You go out here, you go up that tower. He locked me in there on one of my other files. 
I apparently I just didn't find him in my game. I'm pretty sure he ends up being like back here somewhere. His name is Unbreakable Pat. Patches has been in every single game, but I think Dark Souls too. He was in Demon Souls. He was in the original Dark Souls. He was in he's in this game, Dark Souls Three, and he was in Bloodborne as a spider. I think two is the only game that Patches has not been in. He might be in two. I just I don't remember ever finding him. Yeah, I might, might as well put Aldrich's fucking cinders here. His goopy ass stupid cinders. Fucking nasty ass Aldrich. I don't remember Patches being in two, but he he might be hidden somewhere. I don't think he was in the game though. Let's see what this guy has to say. Apparently nothing new. Most illustrious Lord Seeker. Oh, this might be new. Or should I say Lord Slayer? Fine kindling for the thrones, is it not? Each soul truly worthy of lordship. And all slain by thy hand to bind them to their thrones, even in death. Oh, I have no qualms. For as we are to our thrones, thou art to thy duty. In fact, Methinks thou hast helped these poor lords along their rightful path. Ah, my Alright, now he's repeating. I like how he's basically like, I don't care that you killed them, it's our duty to be here. So I'll just sit here and watch you plop down everyone's dead ashes back on their throne. Alright, what does Aldrich have? Probably just has magic stuff. Here's at least one of his. He also, he also has a bow. Steal HP of bows using an illusionary scythe. Aldrich dreamt as he was... Aldrich dreamt as he slowly devoured the god of the dark moon. In this dream, he perceived the form of a young pale girl in hiding. What the fuck? I wonder if he killed uh, Gwendolyn or Guinevere. Oh, here's here's a Gwendolyn item right here. Yeah, it, he, they were devoured by Aldrich. I guess Aldrich killed them. This golden bow is imbued with powerful magic and is most impressive with moonlight arrows. I guess Gwendolyn was killed by Aldrich. Good to know. Doesn't seem like I really want any. There's a long bow. What does it even require? 10 intelligence and 16 dexterity. I really don't care. And then there's a spell. So I also really don't care. So I'm probably just going to go ahead and eat. This shield could be pretty cool. Too bad you need 40 fucking strength and it weighs a goddamn ton. No, no. Alright. I'm gonna get to the end of the game, they're gonna be like, you need to have all the souls from the big bosses to progress. <laughs> I'm just gonna get screwed over and not gonna be able to complete it. Alright. Let's see what this says. When Aldrich ruminated on the fading of the fire, it inspired visions of a coming age of the deep sea. He knew the path would be arduous, but he had no fear. He would devour the gods himself. Well, he killed fucking Guinevere, or Gwendolyn. Killed them. So, apparently he did. <laughs> Alderic does not give a shit. Let's go ahead and use these souls and then level up. 15,000 for that. That was kind of piddly. Why was it only 15,000? I got 10,000 for that. I got 143,000 souls to work with. That's probably like, I don't know, three level ups or something. Two level ups. Probably not a whole lot. Three level ups, what do I want? Strength, strength would be good. Let's go strength. Uh, let's go... Let's go one vitality, maybe. I do have some equipment I kind of want to use, but at the same time, I'm probably okay on equipment. Let's go vigor and endurance. Sounds good to me, all right. I'm like 5K soul short of another level up. I still don't think I've gotten any chunks of Titanite. Which I think is what I need to upgrade my weapon. Let's give him the coal. 
Oh, we have two. We have two coals. I haven't given him this coal. When the hell did I get this coal? Who knows? No words. Where did you happen upon this coal? This is much too dark. I see the abyss in it. Yet a smith I remain. I won't turn down a request. But forget not. Your fight is for the flame and for your fellow kin, just like mine. A cursed fate this may be, but hope remains, does it not? I feel like I'm not giving Andre enough personal space here. All right, there we go. Uh, apparently, he doesn't really want to use it, but because we gave it to him and we requested him to, to work with it, I guess he'll use it anyway. My, my. The coal of that peaceable giant. Seems like ages past. I imagine his passing was long ago. I miss the old bugger I do. My thanks. I'll be sure this coal is put to good use. I'll be smithing weapons never before seen by the likes of ye. It's but a small service to pay my humble respects. <laughs> Andre is like the best fucking character. He's great. Kind of sad that he misses the old giant. I guess they talked. I guess they knew each other. I don't think he's gonna say anything new. Andre, this guy's like the best fucking character. All right, we don't have any of that. That's fine. I don't think I, yeah, nothing needs to be repaired. All right, so where is my? Let's see. I still I still have no Titanite chunks. I don't know where the fuck to get Titanite chunks from. If I could upgrade this one more time, it would turn into an A scaling on strength, which would help out a little bit. Still have this uh I still have the dark blade somewhere. I feel like I'm just gonna stick with the, the broadsword. I don't know where the hell that dark sword's at. Somewhere around here. Where's that bad boy at? Oh it's the heavy dark sword. And I might just stick with the broadsword. <laughs> Ugh, cough came out of nowhere. All right, let me try to infuse this. Actually, let me try to infuse like a different weapon. Well, I guess I could infuse this too. See if anything's better. Not a refined, a refined broadsword. Yep, good old refined. Raw crystal, simple. I don't know what what doing like simple does. Oh, I guess. Seems like it makes it magic. Really don't want magic, fire, we got chaos. Chaos might actually be pretty good. Actually, no, never mind. I don't think it's gonna be pretty good. You got deep. You got deep, you got dark, you got blood. You got poison, hollow. What the fuck does hollow do? I have no idea. I feel like I just want to upgrade this normally. Even though I've already infused it to be heavy. Let me check something real quick. What is, what is a ho Infuse to create a hollow weapon. Stone plentiful and Londor. Great. Hollow weapons are said to peer into the essence of its wielder, whose luck boosts attack. All right. Well, I really just need Titanite ah. chunks, but I have no idea. Oh, we have Umbral Ash? Easterner's Gracious. Ashes. Pass it. Let this ash. I only hope the uh, uh, shouldn't say anything Ashen about that at all. <laughs> Nothing new, at least. What does she got? She's got Titanite scales, Twinkling Titanite, Large Titanite Shard. No chunks. Of course, no chunks. You already bought those. Those are spells and are useless. These are different weapons that I probably don't care about at this point. Because I am sticking. I get this night shield. I don't even know what shield What shield am I using. What shield am I? I'm using the shield of want. It's got 58 stability. It's not too bad. Bet the night shield has less stability, but you can probably parry with it. 48 stability has like 10 less stability. Kite shield. 
Lothric Night Shield. You can parry with this thing too, it looks like. Yeah. Stability's a little bit better. I'd probably go with the Lothric Night Shield. It seems like some of the magic stat, like the magic blocking goes down a little bit. You know, fucking, I don't know what else I'm going to do with my souls. I might as well buy this and see if I like it. Even though I'm never going to parry. Got to practice one day. Helm of Fate. This is, this is Lotrix helmet. Maybe it's not. It looks like his helmet. This looks this looks like oddly similar to Lotric stuff, I'm pretty sure. And it's all called like, you know, whatever of favor. And I'm pretty sure he dropped the ring of favor and protection in the first game. Oh, we got Smo stuff too. Look, we got Smo stuff. Oh, I didn't I didn't know Smo's armor was in this game. Alright. I wonder if Ornstein's is somewhere. I might have to get some different ashes to get it. I don't really see it. Wolnir's crown, Sage's big hat, Xanthus stuff. And there might be some, there might be another set of ashes that you need to get to get Ornstein. So I swear I've seen phantoms, like, running around that looked like Ornstein. It's pretty cool. You can get Smo stuff. It's nice. Got all this random knight stuff. Arrows. I don't know if I need arrows. Rings. Wood grain. Oh, slows equipment degradation. Raises maximum HP. I don't know how to get Ornstein stuff. I swear his stuff's in the game, but. Let me switch out the shield. Pretty much everything goes down, but you can parry. You can attempt to parry with the shield, though. It probably wouldn't go very well. Stability goes down. I should probably upgrade the shield, to be honest. Since I'm not really doing anything else with my... I'm not really doing anything else with my shards and any or any of that stuff. And I think you can only... Well, I guess you can reinforce some other stuff other than just pure weapons. You can... You can reinforce your talismans and stuff, but those are all considered weapons. Kind of sucks you can't reinforce your armor. I'm not sure why they kept it out of the game. Uh, I need Titanite shards. I got 69 Titanite shards. That's a nice number. I might as well just upgrade this so I get a little bit more stability and a little bit more... Pretty much just stability. Still got tons of large Titanite shards. I should be fine to upgrade this shit. Now the chunks... Well, the chunks are fucked. I wouldn't use chunks on the shield right now anyway. I still need to upgrade my weapon. Weapon's a little bit more important than the shield, I'd say. I think, I think we might be done in Firelink now. I always try to get through Firelink as fast as I can. Because I always spend, like, way too much time dicking around here. Welcome, spirit. I think I got a decent amount of stuff done here. Terrifying.